I had no faith, right? So AA was my... That was my next question. AA was my church, right? Wow. And I didn't know it because AA believes in a higher power. And I I always believed in God. It's just that I wasn't connected. And um, then as I got on my faith journey later in life, like I, I I came to faith at 47... Um, Explain and, that, Lily. What did that look like, the faith journey? So um, I was, um, so I got sober, and I was building my business. And since I got sober, it took me five years to clean up the messes, people I owed money to, mm. all the bad stuff. I had to go make amends to everybody. I got to. It was great. Because the whole theory there is, You don't want to walk into a room and see somebody you've offended from alcohol. You owe them money. You've lied to them. You've done something wrong. Now, it's their choice to forgive you, but you have to go address it. Yeah, for sure. And it clears up all the garbage that keeps you drunk. And so, like, I would, you know, I would, I made a list of everybody. Like, I stole the pen out of a drugstore in Illinois, and I wrote the guy a letter. Wow. And uh, offered to pay. And, you know, I was paying people that I owed thousands, you know, 100 bucks a month because I didn't have any money. Wow. But it was about making it, trying to make it right the way you could. And then also being able to walk into a room and not, if I see somebody, like if I had offended you, if you're still mad at me, I get it. Yeah. uh, But I've addressed it. And uh, like with my ex-wife, um it took her 30 years to forgive me. Mm. And it, I, I got forgiveness about five years ago, so maybe six, maybe seven, right around there. And it was, uh, it was awesome. But it was, it was on her time, right? And uh, I think she had to observe me yeah. and believe that she remembered me as I was, not as I am.